gawking. Brown noser. <laughs> okay, you gotta... You gotta go shoot things. Uh, let's take a look at what's up here first. Okay. Because maybe there are secrets. Maybe we get to see Master Eamon. Hmm. Mess hall! That's the door to the mess hall. You know the best part about the Night Watch? More than stew. Food will never ever go bad. That's true. It's just permanently frozen. All the time. Tuttle, I gave you orders. So what are you doing up here? How did you lose your fingers? I'm curious. How did you lose your fingers? You're curious, are you? Are you curious what it's like inside an ice <laughs> cell? No, sir. Didn't think so. Now, if there's nothing else you need... Sorry, sir. I'll get back to I don't want to ask him about the North Grove, just in case that, like... Uh, yeah, I don't know. That causes too many questions, mm -hmm. maybe? Or who knows who he would tell. That's true. All right, I think the only thing we have left to do down here is who's that? This guy? <laughs> he seems very like a little stone. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's been like sniffing the pit. <laughs> he's know? just very relaxed, counting barrels of pitch. I mean, counting barrels of pitch. <laughs> I mean, pitch is what? It's like black tar and solvent, right? Yeah. So if you sniff it, it kind of. Oh, okay. It's, it's the so same. He's, uh... It's like sniffing paint. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Don't sniff paint, by the way, kids. It's not no bad. Paint. That's not. That's not a good thing. But I think he's been sniffing it. <laughs> it's also warm. Yeah. So he just sticks around and just breathes it in, and then it gets kind of loopy. All right. Let's help, um, Mr. Puck Potatoes over right. here. Oh, we don't have these where I- Oh, shit! Shit! <laughs> Man's Raider will shit himself when he sees you coming. <laughs> Did you just put that straight through a foot? Yup. So, you lock that thing. Okay. Alright, let's see if you can aim worth a wildling's ass. Oh. Shoot the targets I tell you to. Okay, how do I do that? Let's start easy. Middle dummy, center of the chest. Oh. You can follow orders at least. That's Next cool. Bolt. Left target, head. Good. Nice. Right target, chest. I'm moving, I'm moving. Not bad. Center between the eyes. Doesn't have eyes. What eyes? There are no eyes. One less wildling. You hit all of them. Nicely done. Ooh, if I remember correctly, the Pope outlawed crossbows at one point. Huh. Finn thinks he's so bloody clever. If a real wildling got his hands on him, ah, he's just a bully. Yeah, I see. He mm -hmm. is. That's why I took this. <gasps> Swiped it right off him. Cutter. He isn't Hell, all right. I don't think he'd take it kindly. Ah, uh, give it back. Give it back to him, Cotter. Are you mad? That's the last thing I'll do. <sighs> Cotter. But, uh, yeah, at one point, like, what- You're at pathetic. Ooh. Fuck off. You didn't even try. A crossbow's a coward's weapon. Besides, I could hit that dummy from here with my- Where is it? Where the fuck's my knife? If someone has it, I'll cut their fucking balls off. How the fuck should I know? You were the last one I showed it to. Well, you and- It was you. What? You little fucking thief. It weren't me. Finn, don't. Give me my knife. 
I don't have it, I swear. Out of my way! Get it! Do something! But stop it! Before some- <laughs> Okay, I see how this is gonna be. I won't say it again. Step the fuck aside. If you ever hit me again, I swear I'll be. <gasps> okay, fine. This is how. Okay, we're gonna do this one then. Fight! Fight! Yeah, get it! Here they go again. <laughs> oh shit! Ooh! Lock! Lock! Rope a dope! Nice. Wait, how am I doing this? Oh. Oh. Get off. What is going on? I here? wanted to punch him, but I couldn't. Push a button. No, I was pushing didn't. all the buttons. Garrett defended him. The last thief I caught no longer has hands. I swear I don't have it. He must have hit it. <laughs> and you. I expected better, Tuttle. Instead, I find you doing this on your first bloody day of training. Sir, Not I... Not another word. You clearly need a few days scrubbing the latrines. Frostfinger, uh... I need another man atop the wall. Fine. Let him freeze his balls off. Nice. I'll deal with this one. Get off! <gasps> oh! Mind your fucking manners. Yep. Very, like... Yep. Schoolyard bully. Come with me. Except I actually us. wouldn't have expected him to to say that. Well done. You <laughs> I kind of like Connor. <laughs> <laughs> He's very slick. Connor. <laughs> but he lies. Yup. Way too easily. This way. Oh, look at the light. Mm -hmm. This is such a pretty game. It is. I look love at that. King's Landing in the afternoon. The sun just barely kisses your skin. You used to love this place. Not anymore. Remember, we'd come listen to the musicians in the evening with Lady Marjorie. You're right. It's beautiful here. Oh, let's humor her for a little bit. See what's really going on. What are you doing? You'll see. Queen Cersei's finest line. <gasps> Where did you get? Wow. Come on, sit down. Where, Where did, did you, you get, get that? that? I know a boy who keeps the queen cellar well stocked. Nobody will miss it, I assure you. Aside from Queen Cersei. Oh, she's drinking from the bottle. Dang. A little won't hurt. Mm -hmm. It's just What do you wine. think? I, I promise know. you. We're going to be tipsy for the rest of the Peer, No peer pressure. Peer pressure is not good, kids. Don't do that either. Suit yourself then. So, I, uh. I have a drinking problem. <laughs> no shit, damn. Oh, what's going on with her? She's really well, nervous. I just... Yes? I'm not very good at this sort of thing. Listen, if I tell you this, Mira, you must promise She's pregnant. to keep it yourself. You can tell no one. I want to trust you, but I need you to promise. I swear. I won't tell a soul. My mother was a handmaiden to Lady Elena for many years. Okay. She became pregnant. It was a disgrace to her family. My true name is Sarah. Flowers. You're a bastard? Yes. I'm fortunate to be where I am. I know that. To always have to hide. I don't want to hide from you as well. What of your father? Who is he? I don't know. My mother died not long after my birth. She doesn't know who her father is, mm. just that he's nobility. Who else knows about this? 
Lady Marjorie. Okay, her grandmother. And now you. Three people. It's just... I don't want to be Sarah Flowers forever. I need Lady Marjorie to arrange a marriage for me. It's my chance at a life. A family of my own. That's why she was on about marriage in last episode. It's not something I can simply ask for. I need her favor first. I know she often confides in you, and I was hoping that maybe... Sometime when she comes to you wanting to talk, you might suggest she talk to me instead. What do you Give think? me a chance to win her over. Yeah? Coming from you, it's sure to mean a lot. Please, Mira. Of course, Sarah. Thank you, Mira. Thank you. I'm so sorry. Here I am talking about myself. I know your family's troubles are much greater than mine. With what happened to your brother and your father. Another brother? Mm hmm. Another brother? You sure you won't have any? You look like you could use a drink. Hmm. A conspiracy of handmaidens. Damn it, Tyrion! <laughs> it's the. Oh my lord. It's the Ladies? proper collective noun. What have we here? Instead of a murder, it's, it's a conspiracy. Drink from that flagon? You're going about it the wrong way. Care to join us, Lord Tyrion? Sure. Hmm. <laughs> I love his faces. This is Cersei's daughter. Not one. the finest arbor red, but a oh. favorite of my sister's. Quite expensive for a handmaiden. I'd be curious to know how you got hold of it. Since I'm certain my sister didn't give it to you, she won't even share with me. I took it. Though that's hardly surprising. I took the wine from the cellars. Aren't you full of surprises? I Listen. suggest bringing cups next time. There are risks worth taking. Stealing wine from the Queen <laughs> Regent isn't one of them. Especially if you wish to have an alliance with me. Uh. Things have changed. My father has recently taken an interest in Ironwood. Most of the Royal Navy went up in green. Oh, field. that's a good point. It is after Blackwater. He insisted I handle things myself. I'm on my way to meet representatives of Lord Whitehill. Lord Whitehill? He's hired a pair of merchant lords to broker for his house. It would seem Lord Whitehill wishes to sell the Ironwood right out from beneath your family. I don't know much about the man. But judging by his up-jumped swords, negotiating with him won't be pleasant. I will speak for House Forrester. Perhaps you could. Come with me. Mm. These men think I have no choice but to deal with them. Ooh. Imagine their surprise when I bring a Forrester to the table. Nice. It might be the first fun I've had in months. This is less stressful than last episode. I mean, it's still stressful, but... My lady. Ramsay uh, hasn't made an appearance. I think it's less stressful at this moment because Tyrion's basically holding our hand. Tyrion's great. Sarah's like, glug, glug, glug. She seriously has an alcoholic problem. Yep. We've been waiting here for an hour. Andros, be courteous. Courtesy in a merchant. Like finding gold in your chamber pot. Oh, he likes Apologies, this. Apologies, baby. Mm -hmm. Who is this? Some girl you've brought for entertainment. She's a lady, Lord Andros. That much is clear. My name is Mira Forrester. Dun, dun, dun! Mira Forrester? Why are you here? A fair question. We were told we would be speaking this to Lord Tyrion Lord alone. Forrester? This is no place for a forester. Perhaps you should ask Lord Tyrion. I asked you. Andros. She's here for the same reason you are. Ironwood. I'm sorry, Lady Mira, but we've already spoken to Lord You Tim. spoke, I listened. Lady Mira has since persuaded me to consider her offer first. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse us. You're going to dismiss You can't us? do this. I assure you, I can. <laughs> this is Can't a mistake, my lord. I don't think so. Lord Whitehill will hear of this. He's not a man to take such matters lightly. 
Nor am Stare I him down. Andrews. <laughs> Lord Tyrion. Just like your silence. Great. Lord Tyrion. Totally fine with that. Let me know when you've come to a decision. I'd like the opportunity to change your mind. Lady Mira. Good day, Please. gentlemen. Uh, it's just merchant. Over yeah. Two oh, merchants well, hired by White Hill. That was fun. Now, as for your offer, what did you have in mind? My lord? The crown's ironwood. I assume you have a proposition? You had a reason for coming here. Oh, right. I know it wasn't just to entertain me. My family can supply all that the crown needs. You're suggesting the foresters be our sole supplier of ironwood. Lord Whitehill will be left in the cold. If he wishes to sell to the crown, he'll have to do so through your family. You will have him at your mercy. Or you'll bring your houses to open war. You do know that's a possibility, don't you? With you as a partner, that won't happen. As Master of Coin, I can do many things. But sending an army to the north is not one of them. However, I know your house needs this. I'll consider the arrangement. Of course, you'd have to do something for me in return. Don't worry. The terms will be fair. What? What is it you want? You'll know soon enough. <laughs> we have an understanding. Oh, Tyrion. Thank you, my lord. I'm like almost totally okay with anything he gives. This will either be very you know. good for both of us, or very bad for you. <laughs> yeah, I like Tyrion. For your sake, I hope it's the former. Lovely. Speaking in riddles. My lady. He's sweet on us. Mm-hmm. The pressures of family. She's been unlocked. Oh, we're back in Essos. Ah, this is fun. Get to be a badass with Uncle Malcolm and Beska. Beska. That's a master. Why would you continue dressing like that? Pride. And standing in the middle of the street. Oh yeah, I would say pride and generations of them being told not to or not to have to. Mm-hmm. Okay, they were headed for the main gate. I know another way. You're coming with us then. You don't have a lot of choice, Bashka honey. If you're to save your house, you'll need more than the two of us at your side. You'll need an army. That's why you're here, isn't it? To hire one. Possibly, yeah. <laughs> we recently An came into some of money. army of and a man to lead them. Do you hear what I'm saying, boy? Beska can lead them. Beska can lead them. What? She's stronger than most knights in Westeros. This is your fight, Asher. Your family. But I'm no that leader. That matters without sellswords to hire. And all the companies around here are engaged. With Daenerys Targaryen. Yeah. What about Croft? Any one eyed Croft with the second sons. They're all with the Targaryen girl now. But Croft owes me a favor. I'm pretty sure he hates you. <laughs> no. He'll help us. I'll make sure of it. And how are you going to do that? We didn't part on the best of terms. I'll be charming. <laughs> I'll be charming. Right. <laughs> it's the best. Yup. Well, We're all covered in like blood. Of dragons and her cell swords are headed She's north. got a lot more blood. So we make for Marine. Marine. Yeah, that's true. Wait, She's just totally Marine? spattered. Shit. What? Unfinished business there. I don't want to talk about it. We can't afford any distractions. It's not your problem. It'll be fine. I promise. I trust you. It's fine. I trust you, Beska. 
Oscar. I Two shouldn't kids. have said anything. I said I was with you, little brother. And I meant it. Showtime. Or not. Ponte Renas! Isn't it the guy whose knee we broke? Yup. That's why he's like hugging the other dude. What happens if we kill him? <sighs> Next time we'll kill him. <laughs> you don't see me. I'm a. Whatever the fuck that is. What is that? Oh. Beska, no! Don't. See? Yeah. Nice. Good call. Just Humans are inherently lazy. Mm. That's one That's truth true. I've learned. You did well back there, Asher. You acted like a true leader. You two can talk about it later. We need to get out of here. We do. They won't stop looking for us. Besides, body count just attracts the attention. Foot. I hope you're ready, Asha. It won't be easy. Let's find out. Yes, we'll find out. Good lad. Either we cross the narrow sea with an army at our backs, or House Forrester will not survive to see winter. I don't know which one's worse. Winter or <laughs> yeah, winter or Ramsey Snow. Ramsey Snow is worse. Okay, wow. Ramsey Snow is the worst. <laughs> he is the superlative against which we measure all other badges. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'll buy that. What are we looking at? Oh, there's just leaves. Someone's in our room. Cowboy or Sarah or Cersei. Oh boy! If it's Cersei, we're we're just boned. <gasps> she wouldn't be in our room. Why? Yeah, why would she be in our room? She'd send someone else. Or our night friend, Boston. It says, "Call out open Busted. peak, peak, peak." All right, we can peek. <laughs> 